Welcome to another video learn about. I'm your host Steve Levin and I'm with Doug Hanks and we're talking about more data center bridging technologies. This time it's DCBX I'd like to ask you about, Doug. Uh, what is DCBX and why would you use it in your uh, data center network? Gotcha. So as you decide to collapse your stores and data on the same physical hardware, so as you plug up these different switches, your core boxes, your access, and etc., what you want to be able to do is basically plug and play. So when you turn the switches up, they want to automatically negotiate what capabilities, what queues, and what features do they have. And it uses a protocol called DCBX to do this. And it's very closely related to uh, LLDP. It's just a slightly modified version of that. So it's plug and play for DCB. So it's basically doing the handshakes and making sure that peers agree with their settings or are at least compatible with their settings. Yeah, because the trick is with QoS, the weakest link is going to be the spot where you get all the congestion. So you want to make sure that your solution end-to-end -end has the same feature set. And we accomplish that via DCBX, those negotiations. Great. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you.